here we are looking at zeroing rifles. Interesting thing, if I was firing without sticks, I'd stand, core stable, like this, and shoot the target. Bang. We've got no round in at the moment. So why, when people get sticks, instead of doing this, which is simply imagining the perfect wall popped up in front of you, and you're here, get a bit lower, in that perfectly stable position, why in the magazines does everyone look like this? Doesn't make any sense. Because you'd never in your life take a shot with a rifle like that, would you? <laughs> it doesn't look very good, does it? So, when you add sticks, you bring them to the height, you want your arse under your shoulders, not stuck out. And if the sticks are too low, you don't do this, even at my age, you do this. You just do the splits until your arse under shoulders still in a good position. Now that's part of the story. Sticks take out the vertical wobble, but they leave you with that. Now if I was standing like this, I'm less stable. If I'm standing like that, I'm more stable. But the secret is to work with the movement. Okay, we haven't got a round in, I'll just take that out for a minute. So we're all clear. So in simple two stick technology, you don't hold on the target and try and hold it still. What I do is I start from the left or the right and I bring it in and I pause and fire when it looks good. I generally work best left to right. Okay, now what a hundred, this looks a little bit wobbly because that really, if you think of a DSC-1 like 40 yards, is for closer range shooting. Now we get to the magic of the quad stick. If you see some of our European friends with the quad stick, notably the people who make them, they're like this. Okay, so that is interfering with your wrist. This is almost hitting your chin and you've destroyed the essentially good position by bending and sticking your bottom out. If we pull this back to here, now if I step into it, I can rest this on my chest. If I need to adjust the height, I can bring my legs closer together or I can move them further apart. I call it the disco dad manoeuvre, okay? Kind of weird dance move, but um, this now is an extremely good position. I can actually rest this arm on the stick there and I'm very stable. Get onto target, make sure you're in a neutral position, breathe in, breathe out. and make the shot. And when you reload, stay on target. Don't move. Don't do this. Because that piece of brass wasn't as precious as the deer that you were just shooting at. Okay? So that basically is what it's meant to look like. <laughs>